Hi there, Paul Dombowski from Liberty Street Software. Recently we had a question from a customer and one of the things they need to do with Asset Manage is to look up items and change the status of those items. And the question is, what's the best way or most efficient way of doing that in Asset Manage? And I would recommend you use the lookup feature. It's on the toolbar here. You can also access it by using Tools Barcode Lookup. And after you've become comfortable with the feature, you can just simply select Control D from the Windows key from your keyboard, and that will bring up the dialog as well. So let's go ahead and select it from the toolbar, and this is the barcode lookup dialog box. So what you do is you're basically going to scan, or you can even manually enter the asset number. You can also uh, look up via a serial number or by the barcode field, which is in many cases the UPC barcode of the product. So we'll just go ahead and look up by asset number. Um, and down here you'll notice quite a few options. Uh, one of these is uh, what happens when you find the asset and display means it's just going to be selected. Uh, another option is to edit, which would actually bring up the edit asset window for the product. Um, and the third one is do not display or edit. Uh, now here in the second section we have what do we do when we find the asset. What we're going to do is change the status of the item to loaned out. And we can also uh, change the location, assign the asset, set the audit date. So you can you could do an, an asset audit using this feature as well instead of the asset audit wizard um, which is elsewhere in the program. So, so we've got a couple assets and what we're going to do is look them up and change the status to loaned out. Now, scan the first asset number. Basically, to scan an asset number, you just place the cursor in this field here, and you scan the barcode with your asset, with your barcode scanner, and it's going to enter the text for that barcode into this uh, text field here. So, I do that, and since I'm manually uh, Pasting. I'm manually pasting this asset number from the Windows clipboard. Uh, if you scanned it in, it would select the lookup uh, button automatically. So I look it up, and the item was found, selected, and as you can see here, the status has been changed to loaned out. So let's do it for another asset. And again, barcode, the asset number for that item has been found and the status has been changed to loaned out. So, uh, like I said, we can do that. We can pretty much uh, decide what happens when an asset is found. You can, uh, you can also specify what happens if the asset is not found. Uh, do nothing. Create an, create an edit in an inventory item or silently create an inventory item and put it in this particular location here. So that's all for now. Thank you very, very much for listening.